Uh, you know, they, they did a great job, all the credit to Northwood. They came out and got after our ass, you know, they did, they, they got after us. And uh, like I said, I, I just, you know, set him free game. Winner will have him ready to play, Coach Hanks will have him ready to play, and he did. You know, the first half, the first half there, you know, uh, we were able to get bailed out on a special team touchdown. We were able to get bailed out on a uh, defensive, um, you know, interception there. And so that was that was a big deal and uh, kind of, you know, got us ahead, gave us the cushion that we needed. And then uh, second half-wise, you know, they, uh, they just stay with us. And so uh, credit to them. Uh, great job by our defense there at the end. And, and uh, for as poorly as they played, it, you know, most of the half, you know, they ended up getting stops there when they needed, you know, and, and offensively we, we moved the ball just good enough. And it seems like uh, this season there's been a lot of opportunities before the half where uh, we haven't just quite been able to get over that hump, but today was different converted on a fourth down and got in the end zone. And uh, that's the difference between the tie game at the end and, and being up by a touchdown. Uh, how good does that feel? Yeah, I mean, I, I don't know. You, you throw a lot of math stuff at me there. So yeah, great. I mean, uh, big thing was we, you know, we, we pulled out one at home here and we had been able to do that in our previous two contests. And that was one that's important. And, uh, you know, with, uh, you know, our team can, you know, sometimes we're feasting fan and, and uh, you know, we'll, we'll take them. You know, we'll take them any point we can get them. But the great thing was to see us, you know, play well different phases of the game. And, uh, you know, certainly doing those things at home where, where you know, that was that much good. And the first home win of the season for the Panthers. Congratulations, Coach. Uh, we'll see you next week up in Northern Michigan. Thanks, Matt. Thanks, Matt. It's guys. Uh, return in school history for a touchdown. Uh, we just got done talking with Billy Yakins, who almost had the longest interception return for a touchdown in program history. Uh, on that special teams play that kind of broke it wide open, what did you see? Well, I see I just saw a big, uh, big hole created by that, uh, by that kickoff return unit. They did a great job wiping it up for me, and all I had to do was run. And you also got in on the action quite a bit today on offense, uh, uh, reeling the ball in from Grant Russell. It seems like get a lot of more guys involved on offense uh, when you look at even EJ Colson today getting uh, the bulk of the carries. Uh, uh, what were you seeing out there as a receiver and, and what Northwood was throwing at you defensively? Uh, they were just playing man and end up just back up sometimes and all we had to do was just read the coverage and make the right cut and, and do the right route and hopefully Grant, well I know Grant, can <laughs> throw that ball great. And it looked like uh, uh, and later in the game after that kickoff return, uh, when you were, were on special teams and, and reeling those in, you kind of wanted to break another one, didn't you? Yes, sir. Absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. Every time. Every time I try to get it. Try to get it. Well, congratulations on the win. Uh, nice play, nice game, and we'll see you next week. Yes, sir. Appreciate it. Thanks. Home win of the season. Uh, big game for you uh, after missing last week. Looked like you were kind of chomping at the bit after sitting out for Lake Erie, and all you do is come out here and take an interception 92 yards to the house. Uh, what did you see on that play? Uh, I, I just tried to come out here and be aggressive. I know that uh, sitting out last week, they probably keyed in on that. So they probably tried to come at me a little bit more. Sure. So try to take advantage of my opportunity. And uh, even in the second half, some plays, uh, you had that nice corner blitz there towards the uh, end of the fourth quarter. It kind of threw them off their rhythm and, and forced them into a first and long, and they were never able to really recover. Uh, what, what, was, uh, what did you see on that play as well? Uh, that, that was just a great call. That was a great call by our coaches. Um, they they motion into the boundary. A lot of the time it's a, a jet sweep that they run, so I just tried to beat it to the spot. So, so you add to your uh, program leading interception total. Yeah. Are they ever going to put you out there on offense, or is, is Corey Cantini and company taking care of all that business? Man, no, nah, they're doing good. They're doing real good. I hope I hope I get some plays, but if they don't need me, I'm cool with that too. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Billy. Congratulations on the good game and, and on the win, and we'll see you next week up there in northern Michigan. Yes, sir. Appreciate it.